We've all been there, um, as I hopefully demonstrated in the video, you know, you, you're predominantly working alone, you're holding up a, an item and trying to screw it in, you know, just as you're straining, got it in the perfect position and the screw fo falls off your impact driver. Um, this happens time and time again and, it, you know, it's really frustrating. So recently I've changed the way I, you know, the setup by using my impact drivers and I just thought I would share that with you. Yeah, so the setup I use predominantly, you know, in the past is always the dual impact bits. Yeah, you know, I like them impact torsion bits uh, or the Weira uh, bits here. I mean, they're both good, but the the magnetic side of things uh, just, you know, can be quite frustrating. You know, put your screw in. I mean, it does hold it like that, but then if you're if you're balancing, you know, upside down or even down the way, it falls off. You know, as soon as you move your, your impact, you know, down or a little bit of movement, the, the screw falls off. You know, you can spin this when, when it's... And that happens. Okay, so in light of that problem, um, I have actually switched things around. Uh, so I'll show you what I use. Um, I've discarded the DeWalt bits now. I've actually opted for... These are the bits I use now, which are the Makita Gold Extreme bits. They're pretty expensive and they're supposed to last 10 times, you know, longer than a normal bit, which I don't know, I'm, I'm doubtful, but they do, there's no getting away from it, they do last a lot longer. So what I use is that inserted, I still keep the wrap adapter on. Um, you know, this setup here, it's still pretty much non-magnetic, you know, you can see. Okay, so the product I'm talking about is the it's the Makita Mag Boost that it's called. It's just a small magnet that actually slips over the top of the bit, so you can push that over the bit. Hence the reason I get a 65 mil bit, and then it allows you enough room to put this on. Uh, you don't actually need this wrap adapter, but I just like it for the extra, you know, the extra bit of length. So what this is, just a, a, a magnet. Um, the mag boost as it's called. Uh, yeah, it's so just a typical screw. Put it on, let go, and you're free to, you know, go whatever angle you want. You can even you can shake that. <laughs> no, there's no way that's moving. Um, you can just see how strong that magnet is. Um, it's just it's like having an extra pair of hands. Yeah, so great for anybody that's working alone. I would highly recommend this. Uh, I'll leave links in the description. You can actually spin this impact driver at full speed, so put it up to three. I'll just demonstrate that now. Yeah, so this setup, screw on, let go, no fear of it falling off. You know, and especially if you're holding, um, you know, another bit of weed on here. Right guys, I thought I would just demonstrate the setup I've been using the last couple of months. Um, you know, it works for me. Again, it is fairly expensive. I mean, these these are about seven pounds each. Uh, I'll leave links in the descriptions to you know this setup here. Um, it's well worth a try. Um, a lot better than what I used to use. So just thought I would show you that.